This video demonstrates how to change the display resolution for an Ubuntu 22.04 server running inside VirtualBox. But the instructions presented here should also work for previous versions of Ubuntu servers and hardware machines too. The outcomes for this video include access to Grub Screen and the View Display Resolution options using the Video Info command, Back up and edit the ETC default grub file to change display resolutions. Reboot and verify the new display resolution. Requirements would be an Ubuntu 22.04 LTS server, though this would work with previous Ubuntu server versions and administrative privileges on the server. The next three slides contain additional sources of info a list of the software used in making this video, and a disclaimer. If you wish, you can stop this video to read the slides. Now, I will add that any time you mess around with the grub file, there is a chance you can break your computer and actually get it to stop work. Be very careful when editing the grub file. Here I am logged into an Ubuntu server, and I'm getting ready to change the display resolution of this Ubuntu server. So before I go ahead and change the grub file, which is where I make the display resolution change, I need to find out which display resolutions are available to this machine. So in order to do that, I need to reboot this Ubuntu server and get into the grub command line. And I do this by holding down the shift key after I start it. But because I'm working with VirtualBox, I also have to grab the VirtualBox window and click in that. So let me go ahead and start to reboot. INIT6, hit enter, click inside here, hold down the shift, click inside the Oracle VirtualBox window is to get the focus. And so here I am, ready to go into the Grub command line. Now sometimes I get this and sometimes it takes uh, two or three tries to get everything working together. So don't get frustrated if it doesn't happen right away when you're working with a virtual machine. It's a lot easier with the hardware. So now I key in C to get to the grub command line. And the first thing I'm going to do is set the pager to one in case, in case it goes over a single page in this little small window I have. Hit enter and then I say video info. Hit enter. And you see I've got a number of different resolutions. And uh, I'm just going to worry about these pixels and not about the color depth. And i got 1280 by 1024 is the biggest I have here. And that will fit inside my 1920 by 1080 screen area I have. But I also have a more there. And I'll just hit the space bar. I can go and look at some more. Well, i got a 1280 by 1024, a 1600 by 1200. I think I'll go with the 1280 by 1024 because that's what I can fit inside this area. You can pick whichever one of these you want. Any one of these should work. Once you've got that picked, just go to normal and it will do a normal boot. Or you could hit escape. So now here's my login screen. Login, password. And I want to go to the grub file. I go to CD. It's a little bit easier to show here. ETC default. If I go straight to the directory and work in the directory, do an LS. And there's the grub file. The first thing I'm going to do is back it up. Because if you mess up on the grub file, there is a possibility your computer or virtual machine will turn into a brick or it just will stop working. And then you'll have to go back in and see if you can fix it. I'll do a sudo copy grub to grub.org. That tells me that that's the original grub file. Hit enter. Password. So now I'll open up the grub file with Vim. Vim comes with Ubuntu server. So the first change I'm going to make is 
You see this line right here where it says grub command line Linux default? I'm going to put no mode set in that line. Hit an I for insert. And then I'm going to go down to the bottom and add another line giving Ubuntu the resolution that I want it to set it to. And that's grub underscore gfx payload Linux equal 1280 by 1024. Once I have that in, I'm going to go escape, right quit. Then I'm going to have to do a sudo update Grub, hit enter, then I'm going to reboot, and that should be it. And you can see I've got a uh, 1280 by 1024 screen here. And I'm ready to go. Now, if you're in virtual box, you can also do the scaling, simply go to View, Scale Mode, and note that the host key is Right Control, and to get out of Scale Mode, you do Host C, Right Control, and then the C. So I'm going to switch to Scale Mode. I don't personally like Scale Mode. If it doesn't automatically go to this window here, you can kind of drag it however you want it. I'll show you right here in the corner. So that's it for changing the resolution on Ubuntu server inside VirtualBox 7. Thank you for watching this. If you have any questions on this video, please ask them in the comments below. Also, if there is a video you would like to see made, please let me know. While I can't promise anything, I will try and look into it. Cheers.